Well, the coronavirus pandemic has impacted a lot of big industries here in Central Florida. Of course, restaurants and tourism. Well, now we're hearing about horse breeding. As News 6's Crystal Moyer tells us, it is a big business in Marion County where many horses go on to become champions. The horse breeding and training industry here in Marion County has taken a hit since the coronavirus. Horsemen here in Ocala say they haven't been able to move or auction their horses until today. And if you didn't know, Marion County has been dubbed the horse capital of the world, generating about two and a half billion dollars a year. David O'Farrell is the farm manager here at Ocala Stud and says a lot of investment has already been made to breed and train these racehorses. Postponing or even canceling auctions for these horses could mean major losses. It would be devastating. You know, a lot of our horsemen, they rely on selling their product, uh, whether it be as weanlings, yearlings, or two-year-olds. Some of the largest auctions happen right here at Ocala Breeder Sales Company. Many of the horses from the area turn champions and their pictures end up on the wall. Due to the virus, April's auction was postponed, the stables empty. These horses are just like athletes in training. Um, when you keep po postponing or delaying when they're supposed to make their appearance on the track or, you know, perform, you know, because they're really trying to perform their best on that particular day. Agritourism is also taking a hit here in Ocala. The owner of Gypsy Gold Horse Farm says he relies on group tours to make ends meet, showing off their unique Gypsy Banner horses. With this coronavirus, that stopped completely. We were giving tours to 800 people a month. With the state opening back up and racetracks continuing to host events, these horsemen say they are gaining confidence that the horse industry will regain its strength. Ocala Breeder Sales say they will be holding an auction in June and things will be a little bit different. They've added an online component to cut down on the crowds inside their auction room. In Ocala, Crystal Moyer getting results, News 6.